So for today's video, I'm going to be doing something super special. I am trying clip-in hair extensions for the very first time. Like I have not even put these on. I opened it and I looked at it, but I didn't try them on yet. So um, when a life contacted me to see if I wanted to try this and I was like, of course, I've never tried clip-in hair extensions and I've always been curious. Um, I've always had kind of a lot of hair, but you know, just getting older and I had COVID like in January and I had some hair shedding. So I am super excited to try this and who doesn't want more and fuller hair, right? So it's perfect timing because I'm going out for a girls dinner tonight. So, you know, a good time to dress up. So this is the packaging. I did already open it once just to, cause I was so curious, but this is what it comes with. So these are the 22 inch, I have to write it down because there's a lot of information. 22 inch, seven piece, 150 gram um, hair extensions in balayage, chocolate brown to honey blonde. And the item number or the cell color number is 9-4 slash 26 slash 4. There's a lot of options. So if you happen to have hair like my color range or similar color, you know, that's just what I got. And these normally, I guess, are on Amazon for about 170. And so they're really nice to send this to me. Um, there are other bundles where it's like five piece and those are like 80-ish dollars, I think. And even like lower ones. So these are actually really affordable. Plus they're 100% virgin human hair. And there's so many colors and styles, like almost for sure you're gonna find one that matches or you can also dye it if you want. Like if you color your hair, you can like take it with you to the hair salon and color it or color it yourself. Um, so this is what it looks like. It comes with like an instruction manual, extra clips. And these are like, I think it's called like a seamless clip. They're very thin, they're curved so it molds to your head. These are just two extra ones and like a card for anything, any um, problems you have, you just contact them and there's a one year warranty, which is amazing. So I'm gonna open up the bag. comes like bundled in with a hairnet and I just have like a towel laid down here I think that's good because I'm gonna spray them with some heat protectant before I apply them just because I think it'll get a more even layer of heat protectant because I'm gonna curl my hair so the seven pieces are one four clip piece so this is it's really long 22 inches it's longer than i thought it was going to be i mean i couldn't measure but you know when you actually see it and then there's two three clip pieces two two clip pieces and two one clip pieces i'm actually the most excited for these because i feel like i need to like fill in over here and these are not 100% a color match but I think it'll blend evenly or nicely I don't know my hair color varies just because I'm out in the sun a lot so I don't know I think once it's blended or put in you won't be able to tell I did just wash my hair and dry it um, this is my very first time so bear with me if you have any like suggestions on what I should do please let me know so, so yeah what I'm gonna do first is spray it with a light mist of heat heat um, protectant so I I just used this one in my hair when I was blow drying for the first time it's okay I bought it at Nordstrom Rack it's a little drying feeling I don't know so I think I'm gonna use the good stuff on the hair extensions and this is the Orbe Royal Blowout it smells so good and you can't even tell it's on and you know the smell is orbit it's so good so i'm just gonna lightly mist if 
before I put it on my hair. So the first thing I'm going to do is kind of section off my hair so I have hair to clip it on but low by my neck. I'm not a hair person. Like I love to do makeup, my makeup, but I have no idea what to do with my hair. Yeah, underneath is very dark. <laughs> so I'm just gonna open up the clips and you just pop them like this. And then to close them on your head, you just press it in. And it's very thin and comfortable. You could brush it before you put it in. I have to open all of them. Yeah, if you see, there's like a little silicone um, band right here, and that helps to keep it in. So you kind of just push it in and clip. Push it in and clip. That feels pretty stable. So I'm just gonna go ahead and make a smaller section of hair. They um, sent this to me. If I was gonna buy it myself, I probably for just my purposes, I don't need this much hair because I have kind of a lot of hair. So, I don't know, it might be hard for me to like add all this in, we'll see. I've also seen ways where you can combo the hair, like clip it in to the clip and then just put it like that. I think that's kind of cool. It less sections and I don't know. If there's an easy way to do things, that's exactly how I want to do it. So I'm all about doing things faster, especially when you're trying to get ready with kids. You know, maybe I'll try that. I will clip the three clip ones together. So this is what I mean. I clipped one to the other. So now I'm just going to clip this one to the back of my head. So next are the twos. I think these I'm gonna start putting on the side. So maybe like right here is where I'm aiming for. So yeah, right here, right above my ears, I think is a good place. I just did my nails last night too. These are the Hanakoko, I forgot the name of it, but it's so cute. And I don't know. <laughs> so it's easy to section my hair. So I was just thinking about that. Like I don't even need a, like, a raft tail comb. I just use my nail. And I really like these. It does have a little butterfly that kind of sticks out, but um, not like the jewel, like the, the other one, the Averill, uh, that I did in the last video. And let's see, let's put my hair down. I mean, it looks pretty good already. It's so long. <gasps> like my normal hair comes up to here, I think. I guess it's only a couple inches, but it feels a lot longer. You know, I think I'm gonna separate the three clip because now that I have my hair down, I kind of want to have more volume like right here. Okay, so I just removed one of the three clips and I'm gonna put my hair back down. And the part that I want to add volume to is like right here on the crown. So go, go like this. I guess like right under where it you wouldn't be able to see it, right? That's good. So you just feel for where your skin
scalp is and that's where you're going to apply it because you want to add the base of the hair yeah i think that looks better right it has like a little bit more volume on the top but yet you can't see it and then these one pieces my hair naturally parts right here so i think i will put it around here let's try okay yeah you can't see it um, try to put it right about here And I heard if your hair is very slippy or thin, you can spray where you're going to attach the clip with hairspray and that'll help, you know, give it some texture so that it'll hold and won't slip out. I think my hair's thick enough where it'll be okay. We'll see though. <laughs> so I'm just gently brushing it through. It is crazy. Okay. Look how long it is. Like, I am so impressed. And it totally blended in, right? Like, I just have a lot of different colors of brown in my hair. So it, it totally blended. Oh my gosh, I feel like a different person. <laughs> and yeah, it's like not gonna come out. Like I feel secure. Um, I think I'm, I'm gonna curl it though, because this is, yeah, I could just leave it down. No, I'll curl it. I was gonna use the one and a half inch. Maybe I should use the two inch. I'm just gonna let this heat up and come back. Oh my gosh, I lost track of time. <laughs> playing with no, the hair. So I'm gonna have to kind of hurry and curl this. Probably gonna take extra long or twice as long because it's so much more hair. And I decided to go with the one and a half inch just because, I don't know. Sometimes the two and a half is just like too light of a curl. And this probably needs a lot more. Looks so good. And so I'm just grabbing my natural hair and the extensions. And I'm not curling all the way up. I kind of just want like a, a nice curl at the end. And I would usually hold it longer on my regular hair because I have thick hair, but I don't know about the extensions. I actually want to curl this one outward. But it is curling very nicely. And I'm going to spritz it with just a little bit of uh, hairspray. Okay, so I finished most of my hair. I think I'm gonna fix some of these face framing ones, just cleaning it up. I just want the curl to start a little bit closer to my face. But oh my gosh, these were so easy to curl. And I sprayed hairspray on it and everything, just a really light um, spritz. I think I'll do a little bit closer. Then for my bangs, I'm just going to kind of put a slight bend in it. Okay, I think that's good enough. But wow, I am so impressed with the hair. It feels good. Like normal hair, it feels secure. <sighs> and I feel like a totally different person. I don't know what it looks like from the back, but wow. What do you guys think? 
Um, this is such a game changer. I don't know for getting ready. And especially once it's curled and you take it out, it will stay curled. I do have to think of or research how to like hang them or I guess store them. Um, I've seen people have like these hangers. I don't know if I have to buy that or if I have to like make one, but yeah, I love them so far and I'm so excited to wear them. So thank you to One in Life for giving me this chance to try these out. I never would have bought these on my own and I highly, highly can recommend or suggest trying it out. Um, I've never tried any other hair extensions, but it is totally not like the cheap wig kind of feel. It is like I can't even tell which one is my hair and not. And it blended so easily. So yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you in my next video.